If you're using Canon cameras, I got a couple different ones here, doesn't matter which you use. If you're trying to find out how to change the setting to get 60 frames a second, whether that's in 720 or 1080, whatever your camera offers, if it offers 60 frames a second and you only find 50 frames a second, I'm gonna show you how to change that. Real quickly, what's the difference? Well, your camera offers PAL and NTSC, and this is a nice option, and you just need to change the video format in the menu, and then you'll get the frame rate that you want. If you're in places like Europe or Africa, or you're in the United States or Canada or Japan, the lighting, the frequency which the lighting works on, differs. It's either 50 hertz or 60 hertz, and that's one of the reasons why you would switch your camera from PAL to NTSC. And what you're doing here is you're matching the frequency of the light so you don't get flicker in your image, so the lights don't flicker. Now there are other ways. If you can't change your video system in your camera, it doesn't offer PAL or NTSC, you can adjust your shutter speed so that the flicker goes away. See my other video about doing that. But in this case, we should set up our cameras properly, or maybe you wanna shoot 60 for slow motion and you're only seeing 50. So let's set that up. So on the T2i, if we went over to the menu and we went one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, to the eighth tab with the wrench, you'd scroll down here to video system and you can see it's currently set to NTSC. That's gonna give you the 30 frames and the 60 frames a second. Yours is probably currently set in PAL. If you're seeing 50 frames a second only, you're in PAL. Simply switch this to NTSC, then you will get your 60 frames a second. Over here on the 60D, same thing, we go into the menu and we scroll over to the wrench section and you'll find video system currently set to PAL. That's why we're seeing 50 frames a second and can't find the 60. Switch that to NTSC and go back to our screen and now we have 60 frames a second. All right, that's a question I get a lot. Hopefully that answered it for you. Ask any other questions in the comments and I will see you next time.